get some coffee. Okay, coffee acquired. Time to head to Grand Junction. That person's camp kitchen, it looks like, is just sticking out of the side of their vehicle. I better go tell them. I just stopped to get this picture real quick. Sweet mama. I know we're gonna fit this. Got a little lay of the land. Um, right over here is a trail I wanna do called Zippity Doodah, and then about three miles that way. There is another trail, uh, Hooks and Ladders, I think is what it's called. There are trails everywhere around here. There's a bathroom, which is awesome. And there's a big fire ban going on in Colorado right now. But over here in Mesa County, as long as you have a fire ring, you can have a fire. So we are set. So far, I have this entire campsite to myself. I figured I want to be the one that's way in the back. Because that guy right there is a troublemaker. It's kind of the heat of the day right now so i'm gonna chill for a little bit um eat some pizza and just set up my camp and then we'll figure out what we're gonna do next we're about to take off and go i'm gonna go like eight miles dude you better be ready for that this guy can run he is a running dog
first time being down this little stretch of highway. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. I almost went up that path. I saw a dirt road right there, I wanted to go up. Gotta go mountain biking in Crested Butte though. Man, that's pretty. Stuck in this traffic for about 15 minutes. But look at the view. Pull over and fish here real quick. I can't not fish here. It's gorgeous. Actively fishing. Well, this guy just caught one. <laughs> I was about to say there are no fish in this lake. As a joke, there ain't nothing buying that. So we're going to give it another couple minutes, maybe throw it out one more time in a different area and then call it. I still got to go mountain biking. So yeah, but I'm enjoying myself right now. Coffee's taking a nap, relaxing, loving it. This guy just caught another fish, showing off for his wife over there. He's a provider. Of course. Turns out, Crested Butte is very, very beautiful. Let's go for a bike ride. Up in that. Cool thing, my friends Carly, Sarah, and Caitlin are actually out in Crested Butte or near Crested Butte camping. And we met up in Crested Butte. And now they have an extra spot at their campsite. So I am going over there. There's a pond that I can maybe fish. Um, yeah, it's at an orchard, a peach orchard. So sounds really cool. Right now we're on Kebler Pass and uh, yeah, it's gorgeous, gorgeous drive. <laughs> Big Bee's Orchard campsite. On Friday nights in the summer, they play here. Cover bands come through and they play Grateful Dead. Super cool. That looks like a town, really. 23 miles. Coming in close. Right, one more adventure left. And I'm gonna go to a spot called Welsh Reservoir. It's kind of random. It's a guy walking a dog in the middle of nowhere. I'll tell you what, this Trevor suspension, uh, the Fox suspension, is really doing well. It's kind of stuck. This is a very bumpy road. Watch for snakes. This is crazy. I uh, didn't make it to the lake or reservoir. I didn't want to drive that far out of the way. It looked like it was going to be another like 45 minutes of driving. And then I started to drive all the way back to 70. So I am just going to enjoy this view, which is not bad at all and not gonna do any fishing. and just gonna hang out here. Take some pictures. Actually, Cam is about to die, so this is pretty much it for my trip. I think I'm gonna head back to Denver now. Um, thought I'd sign off 
This is a view I got to enjoy for lunch. Super stoked on that. Um, yeah, it was nice to just be out here taking pictures and just letting copper run around, frolic in the flowers. It was the first big trip in the truck and it was awesome. Um, great way to break it in. And I have just fallen more and more in love with Colorado. Uh, this summer has been amazing so far and it continues to be amazing. Um, yeah, there's just new places. All these places I went to over the last couple of days were all places I've never been to really. Um, other than just driving past them. So it's been really cool to explore a different side of the, or a different area of the state. Right now I'm outside of Eagle, somewhere between Eagle and Yampa and kind of near the flat tops. Um, honestly, I'm not even sure where I am. I just know how to get back. I can hear that bee, that bee is huge. Look at that guy. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and sign off. I'm gonna head out of here. Um, Got a lot of dirt to cover first, and then you can see the trail goes all the way through there. So I got to cover all that dirt, and then um, get on the highway and head home. I've got about a two and a half, three hour drive ahead of me. All right, you ready to go, Copper? He's so over the back. <laughs> all right, y'all. Fun trip. Take care. <laughs>